Firstly, oven dry the sample. Allow it to cool and measure its weight. Secondly, select a stack of sieves suitable to the soil being tested. A stack of six or seven sieves is generally sufficient for most soil and application. The top sieves soil should have an opening slightly larger than the largest particles. Arrange the stack of sieves so that the largest mesh opening is at the top and the smallest is at the bottom. After that, attach a pan at the bottom of the sieve stack. Pour the sample on the top sieve. Add the cover plate to avoid dust and loss of particles while shaking. Then, place the stack of sieves in the mechanical shaker and shake for about 10 minutes or until additional shaking does not produce appreciable changes in the amounts of material retained in each sieve. Finally, remove the stack of sieves from the shaker. Beginning with the top sieve, transfer its contents to a piece of the paper or a larger recipient. Carefully empty the sieve without losing any material, and use a brush to remove grain stuck in its mesh opening. Measure the weight of soil retained in each sieve and note the corresponding sieve mesh opening and number. Repeat step 5 for each sieve. As a preliminary check, the weights retained on all the sieves and the bottom pan are added, and their sum is compared to the initial sample weight. Both weights should be within about 1%. If the difference is greater than 1%, that means too much material was lost or weighing and sieve should be repeated.